Hello, student. So let's try to solve one more problem from CSIR Net 2022. And this uh, exam was held in month of September. And uh, this is a problem from quantum mechanics. And this is a wonderful problem. So this is basically more or less a problem for Fourier transformation. So if you know how we can go for momentum space to position space, then this question is just a, a very straightforward but very conceptual. What is given? There is a, a Sollinger wave equation represented in a momentum space, and there is mod p square plus beta del p square psi p t i h cut del psi t upon del p t. So this is our Sollinger wave equation. So what we have to do? We have to uh, identify uh, the posi the the potential in a position representation. So we have to write potential as a function of r. So Obviously, we can go for psi pt to psi xt with the Fourier transformation. So we know we can easily go that psi pt to psi xt or psi rt we can write rt by Fourier transformation. So when we are going for the, this particular Fourier transformation, this means we can go for momentum representation to position representation with help of Fourier transformation. So my momentum can be written as minus i h cut del as a function of r. And if we want to change my del p, so this del p can be, and my position vector r, can be written as i h cut del p. And what will happen? This del p can be written as, as a Fourier transformation, we can write 1 upon i h cut r vector. So what will happen? My del p square vector is 1 upon i h cut r dot r. So this is del p square is equal to del dot del so this we can use this particular concept so what we will do we will just transform each and everything here and then we can easily identify so this will be kinetic energy and this will be representation of potential energy in a momentum representation and with the help of Fourier transformation we can identify what is the nature of potential in a space coordinate so this thing can be written as minus h cut square and this is del square r in a position representation plus beta and this is del p square is equal to 1 upon i h cut and this is whole square is there i h cut whole square and this value is equal to r dot r and we have to take the square here and this whole thing can be written as psi r t and this value is equal to i h cut psi r t upon del t. Here time is not going to change. We just write each and everything in time and uh, position where it is written in momentum and time. So if we are writing this all thing, then this value is equal to minus h cut square del square r plus, and this is uh, square term is there so 1 upon h cut to the power 4 is there and this is mod to the power 4 mod r to the power 4 and this whole thing can be written as psi rt and that value is equal to i h cut del psi rt upon del t so yes we can identify this is nothing but the kinetic energy this is total energy, so this is bound to be happen a potential energy. So we can write my potential energy as proportional to r to the power 4. So this will be your answer. I think for that, if we can check the option, the option is basically d is the final option. So that is r to the power 4 will be the answer. And other thing will be treated as constant. So you can do this problem in a very nice way. So students, for upcoming examination, you can see there are a lot of problem can come in a way of Fourier transformation. So maybe they will not give the direct question from the Fourier transformation in a mathematical physics, but they 
you have to use all this concept in a quantum mechanics for a fourier with the help of fourier transformation and you can easily change the basis of momentum to position and position to momentum so thank you